that five-year-old, who was unnamed, was shot in the head in front of his two sisters and killed by this guy. There's another picture from here. And people wonder why he did this. But I have a theory as to what happened. I don't know if any of you know who Dean Koontz is, but he's a uh, science fiction writer. He writes weird stuff. And uh, one of his novels he wrote, which was turned into a movie, not a very good movie, uh, but one of the novels he wrote uh, was called uh, The Watchers. Or was it just Watchers? But I don't know exactly if it was that or Watch. That's not very important. But anyway, what it was about was a, uh, a very intelligent dog. A golden Retriever hunted down. I think it was a Golden Retriever. Hunted down by a genetically engineered um, monster. Uh... It was like half baboon or something like that. And it was being hunted down by the... Uh, the dog was being hunted down by this thing. And they were both created in the same lab. Uh, so they had something in common. But that monster which was uh, like half baboon, you know. It was jealous of the dog. And it saw the dog as perfect. And I think what we have here is that Homie saw this little boy, this five-year-old, as better than him. So he shot him out of jealousy. Um, in the novel the dog doesn't get killed by the monster but it ends you end up feeling kind of sorry for the, the monster because you know it uh, it knows it's ugly and not perfect like that dog and it wants to be killed it's sad. And you don't get that in the movie. You don't get that in the remake. You don't get that in the movie version. It's just a monster chasing some dog and killing people in, in, in the path. That's all. But anyway, that's what I think happened here. It was a Dean Koontz situation here. Except the monster killed the dog. Homie killed the little boy. Yeah. Bye.